You're listening to the Paul Cardall Podcast. Please show your support by subscribing along with leaving a review. This is a pretty awesome week. I got the the word that a month ago when we released my song, Love One Another, that it's been listened to over a million times. Now, this is because of you. I am blown away by the fact that I'm able to sit at the piano and people actually want to listen and hear the music. Of course, not everybody, not everybody, the heavy metal people and the rap people may not be into the calm, soothing piano music, but you are, and I love you and appreciate that you allow me to pursue my dream, that this gift that God gave me, I work on it all the time, and in sharing it, I've met so many incredible people, and I am blessed, you are blessed, as we share our gifts with each other. So, love one another, it came out, and uh, this week I'm excited because another song that I've composed from scratch, it didn't exist before, that's the beauty in creation, I composed this piece of music that I think it's my first romantic piece in the classical crossover form. It's called An Evening in Paris. It comes out May 5th, 2023. If you went in the DeLorean with Doc into the future and you're looking back and listening to these episodes, go ask Alexa to play An Evening in Paris by Paul Cardall.
And really, I mean, that's the essence of this podcast this week is just to share this beautiful new piece of music with you. An evening in Paris. What do you think about when you hear that? Are you picturing the Eiffel Tower? Are you picturing streets? People are outside of the restaurants with the tables, having beautiful dinners together, candlelit dinner. Some people are having a little vino. But you walk past and you see that everybody is falling in love. And I was fortunate to go to Paris with my wife, sit outside a restaurant, enjoy the atmosphere, soak it up. And there we created this beautiful memory. Ask yourself about the memories you have created. You can take those things anywhere with you. No matter where I am, I can draw back into this memory of being there with my wife, having this romantic dinner, falling deeper in love with her. I can carry that with me anywhere. The whole song symbolizes this idea that we spend time together, that we take our spouse out. We continue to date them. That's how they fell in love with you in the first place. So continue to date them so they continue to fall in love with you. So an evening in Paris, an evening in Paris comes out May 5th. So go to my website, paulcardal.com. You'll see the album cover, click on it, and it'll take you to where you can add that to your, uh, whether it's Apple or Spotify or Amazon or Pandora or any of the other platforms. So thank you for joining me this week. Please share this podcast, leave a review, subscribe. I love you guys. Have an amazing week and we'll talk to you next Tuesday. Please subscribe to the Paul Cardall podcast wherever you listen. For more information, visit www.paulcardall.com.